2018, 30% of the Lebanese people were living below poverty line, which means less than $4.30 per person per day for food, which is disastrous. In 2019, and after the economical and financial meltdown, and then you add to it the uh, outbreak of the COVID-19 pandemic, that number became 50%. 50% of the Lebanese people are now living below poverty line. And then you add to it the port explosion in, on August 4th in Beirut, which has made it disastrous. So the number now is, is way above 50% of people living below the poverty line. We've always been big supporters of SDG4, quality education. But with the increasing hunger and poverty worldwide, we shifted a lot of that attention towards SDG 2, zero hunger, and SDG 1, no poverty. Like what we did for Christmas, where part of our team did the angel tree, where they made kids affected by the uh, port explosion in Lebanon make their wishes come true. It was emotional help and a bridge from Nevada all the way to Lebanon to let them know that we're with you, we're thinking of you, and we love you, and we will not let you down. The aim of the program is to trigger the electronic food voucher systems that allows families to have access to minimal food supplies on a monthly basis. It is very important on all of us, Lebanese, whether being in Lebanon or abroad, to double down on Lebanon today and not just financially, helping by giving hope, uh, by creating emotional bridges between wherever you're at and Lebanon. It's more important than any, any other time.